Hello, 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 everybody. Let me make sure I can see the comments. I said I wasn't going to show my face, but I'm showing my unshowered face because, hey, this is real life, right? <laughs> so when you are tuning in, say hi. I am just going to go back onto our original post and make sure everybody who wanted a tag knows we're started. Um, let me know when you can see this. I've been having problems with my comments lately. Tammy, yay, oh my gosh, this is like the first time in I can't tell you how long, no, that, ooh, how do I get the light to fix? There we go, that I can actually see my comments. The past like four times, five times, I have tried to go live, I can never see the comments, and I'm like, oh my god, everybody thinks I'm <laughs> ignoring them. Hi, Shirley, good morning. <laughs> oh, is it good night? I don't know. I don't know what time it is where you are, but good morning or good night to you. Hi, Savannah. Hey, Jen. Hey, Misty. Um, so, um, say hi. Let me know where your boutique is located, where you work from. Let me know what you're drinking. I have a rule that whenever I go live, I have to have a glass of wine. Um, I have had COVID for almost three weeks now, and today is like the first day that I feel even remotely human. So I'm drinking a Fresca, and I'm breaking my rules because the thought of having a glass of wine right now after being sick for so long does not sound appealing whatsoever. So maybe that's all I needed to, uh, kick, <laughs> kick my wine habit. So um, say hi, let me know where your boutique is, and I will be right back, and we will get started talking about my secret sauce, Instant Boss's secret sauce, Jen's secret sauce to how we keep our social media popping, right? What's that song? My lip gloss is popping. My lip gloss is cool. <laughs> Something like that, but we're doing social media. So BRB, and then we'll go ahead and get started. Um... I actually do have a surprise for two lucky people on this live or on the replay. Uh, I'll leave it open for um, a few hours. But um, if you don't know who I am, my name is Molly. I am the owner of with love molly wholesale <laughs> we are one of your wholesale besties here in instant boss and i am personally going to be giving away two 25 dollars gift cards to with love molly wholesale and no purchases necessary all you have to do is be watching this live saying hi participating with me. I'll tell you how you can win, but I have two $25 gift cards to give to you and you don't have to do anything but party with me. So keep that in mind. Uh, prize number one, tag a boutique bestie who you think would love to hear what we have to say in this video about social media and how to make your social media game popping. Popping, popping, okay? So go ahead and tag a social media or a boutique bestie that you have. And anyone who does that is going to be in the drawing for a $25 With Love Molly wholesale gift card. We are a women's uh, young contemporary fashion wholesaler. So if that's your jam you're definitely going to want to tag your bestie. All right, so uh, thank you so much. Hi, 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 Shelly, hi, Haley, hi, Tammy again, hi, Chelsea, hi, Becca, Brenda. Hey, guys, we have Oklahoma, Texas, uh-oh. Um, hey, Taryn. Yes, so tag, tag, tag your boutique besties for a chance to win some With Love Molly Wholesale Store credit. And let's get started. I'm going to pop open my Fresca. 
So, um, myself and Jen have our secret weapon. Uh, I can't take any credit for it. However, I do love social media. So um, anytime I get to help people grow their social media uh, is A-OK -okay with me because it is my jam. I love it. And I know it's Jen, um, our fearless and proud leader of Instant Boss. I know it's her jam too, which is probably why we get along. So freaking great. <laughs> but um, Social media is our jam. We live it, we breathe it, and we have so much fun with it. And tonight I want to talk to you about, um, if you haven't heard of a group or a um, business tool that Jen has created that I use, um, I have the app, I'm in the group, I do all the things, um, Small Shop Social, <laughs> the biggest tongue twist twister for somebody who grew up with a lisp, <laughs> aka me, to say. So we're going to call it SSS and keep it that for the rest of the night. So it's Small Shop Social. And how that can really help you with your social media game. Your um, Facebook group specifically, but it can also uh, carry over into your business pages, your Instagram pages, and honestly, um, even TikTok, which is pretty freaking cool because I know so many boutique owners have been seeing wild success on TikTok. So um, it's really great to have these tools at your disposal to be a student. Um, as a business owner, there's literally like the number one thing you can ever, ever, ever do is always be a student. You are going to be a forever student because our world is constantly changing. You're never gonna know every single thing that you need to know about social media or your business or Facebook groups or whatever. So I always say that if you wanna be a business owner, you have to be a forever student. And I am going to teach you what helps me be a forever student. So um, we have a membership here in Instant Boss that is catered to that. And I am going to share my screen. When you join SSS, um, you have so many tools at your disposal. And I just want to show you a little bit of my Facebook group real quick and show you the stats so you don't think I'm BSing you. Like anyone can come on here and just be like, oh, I use I use this app and it's so amazing and yada, yada, yada. But the proof is in the pudding, right? Like you can call BS on any of that unless somebody shows you what their stats actually are. So I'm going to go ahead and get uh, my screen flipped for you. And I'm going to show you my Facebook, my personal Facebook group stats. Oh my gosh, I look <laughs> so terrible. COVID has me all sorts of wild. So please forgive me. Um, and then I'm going to show you what the small shop social app looks like and I'm going to walk you through every single tool that I use at my disposal 24 7 to do so so beep 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 let me Ooh, how do I flip oh there we go oops nope that's not it here we go all right let me turn my flash off Perfect. Let me know if you can see this, if it's blurry or whatever. So I'm just going to pop in here. This is my social media page, right? Hey, hey, hey. I have 2.1K members. Not huge, not terrible. But when you scroll down to the um, <clears throat> engagement, I just want to show you that my engagement continues to rise. We're still up 4%. And look at this, look at my active members right now. Almost 1,700, we're gonna go and say 1,700 active members as of right now out of 2,100. Do you know what percent that is? I do because I figured it out for you. That's an 81% active rate. That means 81% of the people in my group are actually active and want to be in the group with me. 
that means they're commenting, they're posting pictures, they're saying hi to me, I'm engaging with them, and they have friends in there, and they want to be there. So that's pretty freaking cool. Give me a amen sister friend. I'm going to flip my screen for this. <laughs> Give me an amen sister friend if you would love your social media to have a 81% active rate. That's incredible. Like, we're not talking like I'm in grade school and I have to have an A plus 100. No, 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 no. When it comes to social media, it's never going to be that high. This is pretty D-A-M-N good, okay? <laughs> so give me all those hallelujahs. Amen, sister friend, if you want an 81% social media interactive rate. And I'm going to show you how. It's with the small shop social. SSS. So I have it on my desktop, but it is an app that you can get on Android or your iPhone. Jamie says, and um, there's also a Facebook group just like Instant Boss um, for members only, which you're going to get even more. So once you sign up for small SSS, <laughs> here's the cool thing. All of these tabs right here are at your disposal every single day. And I'm going to start with my favorite part, which is this image library here. So we always talk about engagement posts and how important they are to have people in your group and um, chatting with you and making sure they see your post. So look at this. Do you see these? All of these posts, I didn't make a single one of these. I absolutely did not make a single one of these. They are here for October 9th, October 10th, October 10th, October 10th. All of these for me to use at my disposal, all I have to do is download all of them, which I can do simultaneously or individually. And now I have three engagement posts for my social media group every single day. And I didn't make this. Jen makes these for you. Her and her graphic design team make these for you and will give you all sorts of things every single day for your entire membership. How freaking cool is that? That's like amazing. And she's going to brand it to you. So um, obviously um, I do hearts and pink and all of that stuff. So I can pick any of these and schedule them out and wham, bam, done. I freaking love that. So I just want to show you that. So no more having to go on Canva all by yourself. Um, Another really cool part is this mentors lounge and you can ask a mentor a question and each here are some of our big mentors that you've probably seen. We have Amanda, we have Reagan, Robin, Crystal, Jessica, Taylor, all of these people from boutiques that you know and love. Of course, we have our Katrina. We have Liz from Southern Fried Chicks. I know everybody loves them. All of these people, all of these mentors are at your disposal for you to ask them questions, whatever you might have in mind for any of them. How freaking cool is that? There's even a podcast um, that you can listen to mentor toolbox that's going to show you like what are these people's favorite things and what they suggest using amazing again these mentors are doing hundreds of thousands if not millions in sales per year and they're at your disposal <laughs> with this membership that's crazy you have your vendors list which is going to be vetted wholesale vendors um, and you're going to get that with your um, membership. Um, scroll, 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 scroll. Look at all those. Those are all vetted. Oops, sorry. That's my dog. <laughs> sorry about that. Um, all vetted vendors from Instant Boss that you can use. Um, this is something that I actually didn't realize was here until today. <laughs> um but if you want your social media to stand out and be um, cohesive, which is very, very important, my images, I'm going to show you, uh, my images in my group are very distinct. How do I get, where, how do I get out of this? <laughs> Help. 
oh, here we go. Um, just a scroll, like all of my images have a set preset on them and it makes all my photos very, very, very cohesive, right? And that in itself is something that's going to make sure the right people are in your group. Like you can see, I use the same filter on every single thing, right? So I just downloaded a couple of these literally like five seconds ago. And I'm gonna tell you right now which one is my favorite. Um, I did this one, this cozy. It is a vibe, guys. So I love that. So I'm definitely going to be using these on my um, Instagram and Facebook um, public pages. I think I did cozy and I did minimal and I absolutely love them and they're going to go perfect. And it's going to attract the right people just based off of the images. So I love that. Um, <clears throat> product names, if you ever get stuck. Um all these things that you can use. If you can't think of some fun, creative names, you can always use that. Um, templates here for um, questions. Now, one of the biggest tips that we have for your social media groups is that you have to not only invite people, I'm gonna flip my screen, um, not only invite people to engage with you, but also you have to engage back with them. So, um, hey Mode, hey Jen. Um, so with that being said, a lot of what, um, not in the app, but just in the small shop community on Facebook, um, a lot of that you're gonna get extra stuff in there too. Um, what I love is as your mentors learn things, for example, like TikTok, um, as they learn what works, they're going to share it with you in that group. As Jen learns more things that help her Facebook group be even bigger and better than it already is, she shares it as it's happening in that group. So it's not you fighting with the algorithm, fighting with the algorithm, and trying to uh, stay ahead of it when in actuality you're actually always three steps behind because you're learning it after the fact, and then it's probably already changed already. What I love about the small shop community is you're going to be learning things as they evolve so it's not too late. That always used to be my biggest thing is I felt like once I finally got a handle on social media, it had already changed. So I had like three days of um, <laughs> consistent engagement and then it had already changed already. So I had to start all over, right? And you never want to be three steps behind on social media. You always want to be three steps ahead and be on that end of the curve. And the actual um, Facebook community helps you do that. Um, so that's one thing that I love about that. And it's going to remind you again, um, it's going to teach you how to use your insights properly. So you are learning. It's going to give you um, tips. It's going to give you access to the mentors. It's going to allow you to ask questions. I mean, it's it's honestly mind boggling how much you get with this. It's like having a social media manager at your disposal 24 seven, but you don't have to pay them 24 seven, right? Because if it was an actual human that you hired, you're going to have to pay them by the hour. And if you wanted them to work for you 24 seven, I don't even want to imagine how expensive that is. So that's pretty cool. But the most important thing here about social media is at its core, and I think people forget this a lot. If there's one thing I can help you with, it is this, okay? At its core, 
social media, especially Facebook, but I'm even going to branch out and say especially TikTok too. Um, I'm not a huge fan of Instagram personally. I think Instagram is trash. <laughs> I really do. It places a lot of emphasis on the on someone's um, photogenic nature and I think that's just straight garbage because it just creates all these false realities. So that's neither here nor there. I'm not going to talk about Instagram, but we're going to talk about Facebook and TikTok. At its core, the purpose of it is to surround yourself with like-minded people so you can interact with them. It's not about selling to anyone. It's not about businesses. Sure, you see Facebook ads and all of that, but if you think back to, and I'm gonna be showing my age, <laughs> so I'm old, but when I first joined Facebook, you had to be in college to join. You had to sign up with your college email otherwise you couldn't get in and it was like this cool thing where you could see who went to what college and you could friend request the point of it was to literally find friends at your school and that is actually I swear I swear on everything that is how I made friends in college so I went to the Fashion Institute of Technology and it was really hard meeting people in New York City. I mean, it still is. It's hard meeting people anywhere, but especially in such a big city like that. But that's how I met people in my classes and in my school and people who are in my same degree. Like, that is crazy. But that, at its core is the purpose of Facebook. It's not to, hey, join this group so you can come buy my shit. It's, hey, I have this amazing Facebook community and you and I are very similar and we talk about fashion and we talk about beauty and we do makeup tips and sometimes we even have some sexy talk on girls night and you know you build this brand around what it is I'm speaking about my brand in particular when I used to retail um we had um Saturday shenanigans where we all got a little goofy and we talked about our boyfriends and our girlfriends or like hot celebrities and it was like a total girls night session right um I wasn't just in there saying here's my new dress it's fifty dollars buy it or peace out get out of my group no 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 so you need to be able to have that like-minded aura. If you sell kids clothing, for example, obviously the right thing to do in your Facebook community is clearly your people are parents. And if you do infant clothing, they are new parents. So wouldn't it be wise to have some new parent chat every now and then and not just talk about these new cutie patootie little ruffly undies that you're selling <laughs> like that has to come second okay so that's just me on a tangent but when you can remember that Facebook wants people in your group that want to be there that like you that love talking with you that think you're the coolest person and they want to be your friend in real life they want that. They want that for you. Whether you think they don't or not, I don't care because I know that that's what they want for you. But they are also very smart and they know that you're probably trying to be sneaky and trying to make money off of these poor people instead of actually making a connection with them. And this is how we help you in small shop social. We help you not be so salesy. We help you be fun. We help you learn about algorithms. We help you become a friend of Facebook. So Facebook will be a friend of yours, okay? <laughs> so I don't know. I went on a tangent there for a second. I'm sweating. This light is so hot. I probably <laughs> have a fever right now. I'm not so sure. But I hope all of that makes sense to you. Um, so there's so, 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 so much more that I could show you. Um, but it is closing. 
So that's kind of why we're talking about it because we want you to get in now and we want you to get in at the locked price because it's going away. Only for a limited time though because what Jen is doing is she's closing it up because obviously Facebook is changing. You all saw it. I saw it. She saw it. So many massive updates are happening right now and she is taking the time to really focus on all of that, make the membership even better than it already is, focus on us who are in that and help us be the best Facebook users, the best TikTok users, the best social media users that we can be. And then she's gonna open it, it, open it back up, but it's probably going to change in price, so if I were you, I'd want to get grandfathered into that, uh, like I am, <laughs> so you can get all that even better stuff for the same price. Um, so that's kind of why we're talking about it, and I do believe, if I'm not mistaken, it ends tonight. So um, if you have any questions, definitely drop them below. Jen and I are always happy to help. If you're like, hell yeah, sign me up right now, drop that below too and we can get you the link and get you in w within minutes super super easy um this replay will be up of course so you can always catch it and um last but not least we are already giving away one 25 dollar with love molly wholesale gift card if you tag a boutique bestie who you think could use these social media tips hey Brittany. Hey, Haley. Oh, so glad to hear it. We can definitely get you back in, especially right now, um, because you don't want to miss out on the price. <laughs> but um, the second way to win a gift card is I want you to drop me one thing that you really struggle with, with social media that you would like your mentors in SSS and Jen and myself and all of the SSS members to help you be better at. It's not gonna be a vent session, it's not gonna be a pity party, but one actual thing that you really struggle with that you think would be a very valuable lesson for Jen to add in small shop social, okay? Because <clears throat> that's why she's here. <laughs> that's the whole purpose, is to help you be successful. And if there are burning questions that you have, drop them below. I'm going to pick a random winner to get that gift card. And then Jen has some ideas during this break to help her, to help the mentors for all of us to make sure that you get what you need out of this membership. Um, oh my gosh, Tammy, lives are my jam girl. I'm going to talk to Jen and see if we can hook something up about how to go live because they are, I, I, I keep saying everything's my jam. Am I allowed to do that? Can I just say everything's my jam? <laughs> I don't know. Instagram is not my jam. I'll tell you that much. Mm -mm. I hate it. Instagram is like the old school Victoria's Secret of the fashion industry. Like people don't realize it, <laughs> but honestly, ugh, it's just cringe, right? I think it is. It's ugh, egocentric. <clears throat> you have, I don't know. Anyway, neither here nor there. But I love seeing these. What else do we want to learn? The algorithm. Haley says she wants to learn how to get new followers. Um, Melissa says ways to organically grow. Um, we can definitely help you with that. Um, yes. Oh my God, Jen, right? So like, I feel like Instagram is just the social media version of how to help you think your life and your and you are unworthy, right? Because all these like beautiful people with butt implants and boob implants all over your feed and it's just cool. <laughs> um, relating to my customers, making my group into community. Oh girl, yes, we can help you with that. We can help you with that. Um, I know Tammy said lies. Um, yes. What else do we have? The algorithm. Yep. So these are all really awesome things. 
Um, and I know for a fact that even I personally can help you with some of these. Um, but we will definitely look at all these responses and maybe come up with some fun ways to help you with that. Um, thank you so much for allowing me to um, spend our Monday night together even looking the way I do and drinking my Fresca and I think I have sweat dripping down my face but she you say making your group a community and relating to your customers well here we are sometimes you just need to go live sweaty unshowered with COVID and a Fresca in your hot ass room <laughs> and let people know hey this is who i am and you can like it you can love it you can hate it you can leave it doesn't bother me because this is who i am and that's really what it's all about uh carrie says lives and posts that aren't just salesy yes girl yes that is what we are talking about that is the bread and butter eh, of everything that is the absolute bread and butter because once you can master that, the sales are going to come because you don't have to post buy this, buy this, buy this, buy this, buy this, right? You can post, hey, let's chat about this or hey, let's chat about that. And then eventually you learn how to make your sales posts, sales posts that aren't sales posts. <laughs> Does that make sense? So you can, in your mind, you're like this is gonna get me sales. But I'm not posting about a sale, right? I'm posting a picture of me in this bomb ass outfit because I'm about to go have drinks with my girlfriends and I'm gonna say, hashtag Saturday shenanigans, what are you doing, right? And you're gonna post that picture and people are gonna comment what they're doing, but then they're also gonna be like, girl, you look fire, I need that top right now. That, we love that. Laura struggles with that. I feel like nothing personal to post about. That's okay. And that's what I'm talking about, about Instagram, right? Because we start feeling that our life is unworthy. Who we are is unworthy. And that's why I hate that platform. So you have to get that out of your head. Like, I am nobody cool. <laughs> I'm like, again, what about me right now says I'm a business owner? Absolutely nothing. I don't look professional. I sure as heck don't sound professional. I don't act professional. I'm just, I'm just me. And if I can make one suggestion before we leave, and then again, maybe Jen and I can chat about this more, but um, think of five things that you love, that make you you, and that you believe are something that can be on brand okay so <clears throat> those are the things that you can just keep reiterating for me personally I love wine I am a wine drinker through and through on every live that I have I always have a glass of wine in almost every girls night date night picture that I take of me and my outfits I always have a glass of wine. That is something that makes me me. Does that make me special? Does that make me cool? No, but people start to know that I love wine. And when they see something about wine, I end up getting tagged in it because I'm the first person that they think of. Same with dogs. Everybody loves dogs, but I am so religiously when I retailed posting about my dog 24 seven, that again, people think of me when they are seeing dog mom sweatshirts and they tag me. It's just these little things again that we might not feel are worthy of being talked about, being talked about, but that may, Mode, Mode knows, see? <laughs> me and Mode have been friends for a very long time. Um, we have never met each other in person, but she knows my dog's name is Ryder and she knows that I'm obsessed with Prosecco and vice versa. I could list. I know that she is a fabulous. Is into all things black and spooky. If I ever not see her in something black, I would probably be shrieking to the rooftops because I've just learned these random things about her 
from being in each other's social media lives. So that's just how it works. So you don't have to be cool. You don't have to be an it girl. You don't have to have the it factor. You just have to be you and embrace it. Hey, Alexis, thank you so much. We're going to be so happy to have you. Um, my phone is on 7% because, again, I am a hot mess right now. But I look forward to chatting with you guys. I look forward to announcing the winners of the gift cards. Um, I look forward to seeing some of you in small shops social. And most importantly, I am so, so, so excited to grow our businesses together to create a lucrative and meaningful job to create a lucrative and meaningful Facebook group. Yes. So virtual cheers to that and have a good night. Instant bossers.